Boomer. You just distract the police, and I will find a way out of these cuffs and into the night. No. I have already done enough explaining to Chad about how you got free from those ropes, and this will be the second time tonight that you've gotten away with me in the picture. I think you're going back to prison. Well, what if I take you with me? I'll bet you're not going to do that. You tried to kill Chad tonight. You want to see him pay? Let him watch Blow little Abigail's life to hell. Orpheus said he'd get me out of prison if I took the kid. I was never gonna hurt him. And what did you think Orpheus was gonna do with him? Play peekaboo? And what about the little kid's mother? Do you think she knew that you weren't gonna hurt him? Did you leave some kind of note? A nice little note saying you're a nice kidnapper? Hey, I'm sorry, all right? <sighs> You know, the thing is, when I was holding that baby, it reminded me of when you were born. <laughs> Do not. Do not go there. What you did tonight was horrible. A kid had every right to shoot you, and yet here you are, still whining, playing the victim, blaming somebody else. What I want to know is what kind of God takes Sierra and let someone like you live. I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry I didn't make the connection. This is why, why I feel understand why it's so hard for me. This whole thing with Ali and Trip. I see that now. I mean, you were pinning all your hopes on that DNA test that is going to prove that Trip did not rape Allie. What if it doesn't? Then what if he did do what she said he did? Are you going to be able to accept that truth? Did Kate leave? Thank you. 